I'm Wilson Lee and I come from Hong Kong. I've been shooting photos for around six years now. I consider myself to be a professional amateur photographer. And basically I shoot whatever I want, ranges from portraits, streets, architecture and travel photography. So one thing that I find so interesting about the low move on is that it has a 32mm focal length, which is a bit wider than 35mm and a bit taller than 28mm and it actually is a very interesting perspective to shoot on street because usually you can't you won't you won't have the balance between like a wide and tally and the thing is it's a pretty interesting experience to use the 32mm for the length. Another thing about Lomogon is that it has a very short minimum focus distance. So it means that you can get really close to your object and you also get a lot of bokeh when you focus really close. And that's that's pretty interesting when it comes to like shooting for like close up people or tricks. The reason why I love analog cameras so much is that I get to have full control with all the settings. And this low mobile lens is also full manual lenses with a very special aperture dial where you can just by one click you can switch from 5.6 to f4. And I think this is very convenient when it comes to shooting on street where you have to capture that critical moment. With the dial style aperture mechanism, you can achieve full circular bokeh. And this is not something traditional blade mechanism can offer. And it's especially beautiful when it comes to shooting close-up object. When compared with other DSR lenses, the Lomogon is much lighter and much smaller, which makes it perfect for packing in your bag for traveling. The Lomogon lens is just as beautiful as other demography art lens. I think it's very important to like the lens so that you bring it out on street and this is the first step to taking good pictures. I would say the key thing is to think before you shoot. I used to just walk around the street and shooting random pictures but I slowly realized that it's very important to actually have some idea in mind before you go into the place and I think people can really tell the difference and this is one of the key to stand out, I guess. Well, I think the most obvious answer is to go to somewhere new, and that's why I love to go traveling. But even if I'm not traveling, I still go to a lot of different places in Hong Kong during weekend. As more as Hong Kong, I think there's still a lot of places I've never been to, and they're waiting for me to explore. Although Hong Kong is being known for a concrete jungle, but I think there are lots of beauties inside the city. And one of the most interesting thing in Hong Kong is the public housing. And there are very interesting traditional architecture there. And I think you can also explore the community in the, in the, in the aesthetic.